this lighting's a little bit yellow. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. This week on Channel Mum, we are talking about things I wish someone told me. No, things no one told me. And I have got a lot of things that no one told me and I thought I would just talk to you guys about pregnancy and birth and newborn things that I wish somebody would, would have told me. I just said told me, so many times told me, told me, told me. No one told me that it can take months to conceive a baby, even when there's nothing wrong. Yet, the second term round, it takes no months. <laughs> you won't just trust one pregnancy test, you will take at least about four. Being low during your pregnancies is just normal and it's okay. Talk to your best friend about it and get them to support you. Being pregnant doesn't feel real until you have the scan and you see your little baby in your tummy, then it feels real for about five minutes and you go home and it doesn't feel real again until you have a bump. Don't worry about the stretch marks on your tummy, they will fade and you will get over it. Two words, lightning crotch. It is as bad as it sounds. Don't make a birth plan, just have birth preferences. Planning it was pointless. A stretch and sweep is much worse than it sounds. Turns out anyone can have a emergency cesarean, whether you've read about it or prepared yourself or not. A TENS machine is always a good idea. Contractions feel like, you know when you're vomiting and your body's heaving out the sick, it feels like heaving downwards but instead of heaving sick it's a baby. Google what an angry cat looks like before you have an epidural so when they tell you to look like an angry cat you're not just like <coughs> I can't believe I just did that. Don't worry about your other births after having a caesarean because VBACs happen too. Gassinet is amazing, it's your best friend but don't have it before five centimetres. Don't listen to the midwives telling you to walk around the ward in your labour lie on your left side and listen to your body. Once your baby is born, you might not have love at first sight and that is okay. It takes a while to bond with anyone, let alone a little baby that you've never met before. Not all babies are born able to breastfeed. Little boys, we over your shoulder when you haven't got a nappy on them. Day three, when your milk comes in, you will become a total psycho from irrational mum guilt to wanting a divorce. Most people don't just jump back into their pre-prego genes, but you will get there. Your boobs will never be the same again. Waking up into a milky puddle is a thing. Having a traumatic birth and getting your head around what has happened is a bit like a big emotional bus hitting you. Make sure you ask for help and eat lots of chocolate. I wish someone could have looked into the future to tell me that John would be the first to hold my newborn baby while I was coming out of an operation and waking up. Being a mum is the most amazing job you will ever have. You will love those children like you never imagined you could love anyone. So there are my things that I wish someone had told me or things I would say to my self before I had kids. I really hope you enjoyed watching this video and I will see you soon.